Hi folks, welcome to Paul Sherry RVs in Pickle, Ohio. Today I'm featuring a 2014 Thor Citation on a Sprinter chassis with the Mercedes-Benz engine. You should be able to expect around 14 to 15 miles a gallon out of this, possibly better depending on the terrain. It's got the HD outside where the, the gray is built into the fiberglass here. I'll walk around you here, it's inside the showroom, so I can't get a wide angle. There's the awning out, it's power. Walk you down here, it's the 24SR model. There you go. Hi there. Right there. Some storage here. Down there, here's some more storage. There's your Cummins LP generator. More storage underneath there. Tons of storage. 110 outlets on the outside. Some stainless steel wheel simulators. And you also have a slide out the rear. So that has to go in while you are traveling. But it makes your overall length shorter, but feels a lot bigger when you're in the inside. Let me walk you around to the other side now. Here's your Mercedes motor, emblem, fiberglass running boards, slide out awning cover, some more storage down the sides here, propane tank, more storage, this is where you pull out your power cords, about 30 feet, a little tight to get back in there, but there's some more storage, your water heater and your furnace. Gel coat fiberglass. The gray color is built into it instead of the old plain old white that you've seen for years. Tinted windows, windows on the slide there. You fill your diesel fuel. Nice padded seats. Here's your radio. It's a uh, navigational ready. You can add nav, it's all touch screen, air conditioning. We walk you around to the inside now. Okay. Now as you come in the door, you got two steps here, one more near the coach. You have the bow floor, which is slip resistant, won't crack and shrink like normal linoleum. It's like a industrial grade. Up here you got some pedestals in the floor. Those are for setting a, a table on. For eating, you can put one between these two chairs right here. You can; those will spin around, so you can eat off of that. Use that as a dining area. Um, another one sits here. This couch makes out into a bed. You got your full-size bed above. Nice big skylight with a power opening, and there's a blind that covers that, so you can keep the light out. You can have a screen, or you pull it the other way, and you have a blind to keep the light out. Very nice, thinking of everything. Over here's your DVD player that's built into your TV, plus all your controls to start your generator, your lights on the outside. Um, you have tank heaters so you can camp in the winter. It keeps your black and gray tanks warm and your fresh water, gas and electric on the water heater. This will fold up out of the way for getting down into the cockpit. I'll give you a look back the other way here. There's your TV, couch, storage cabinets above it, ample amount of storage, a ton of storage in a small unit, solid surface countertops, storage here, hidden hinges, European style, you have a convection microwave, two burner cooktop, lots of drawers. All metal ball bearing drawer glides, so it's a nice and smooth operation. Storage underneath there. So the point of this video is to try to give you a better view of what the pictures don't. So you can come down and look at it. Big deep sink. Stainless steel. You got a Norcold refrigerator. Runs off of propane or electric. Drawers below it. 
More drawers here, wardrobe. One big hanging closet here. And right back here, you have a queen walk around bed. You have a good mattress from the Denver Mattress Company. And when you drive down the road, I told you this slide comes in, you simply have to fold this mattress in half. Just like that, and then push the button and the slide room will come in, make your overall length just under 25 feet. Now back here, you also have another television that's hooked up to that DVD player as well. Heating and air conditioning controls. You can see the table down there in the corner and the post that it goes on. You have a divider guide here, it will block it off. And then to get into your bathroom, undo that. Now look how huge this bathroom is. So that door folded into a V, blocked off that area. So you have a big changing area once you get out of the shower. Just ample amount of space. We're working in small areas, so we kind of make use of everything we can in this model. Very ingenious, skylight, just enough. And then when you want to get out of the bathroom, simply push the lever here, walk back, and the door closes back again. So 2014 B plus Sprinter chassis, very good fuel mileage. Just got it in stock at Paul Sherry RVs in Pickle, Ohio.